The final steps on the campaign trail. On the eve of the U.S. midterm election, stars of the Republican and Democratic parties stumped for their candidates as both sides call the vote a judgment on the state of America under Donald Trump. Who we are is on the ballot. What kind of politics we expect is on the ballot. How we conduct ourselves in public life is on the ballot. How we treat other people is on the ballot. Heading into Tuesday, Democrats look confident of retaking America's lower chamber of Congress, the House of Representatives, from Republican control. All 435 seats are at stake, and the Democrats need to oust just 24 Republicans to regain the majority. Republicans are looking to increase their majority in the Senate. 35 out of the 100 seats are in play, and most of those are already held by the Democratic minority, some in states that went for Donald Trump in 2016. 36 state governorships are also at stake. 34 million Americans have already cast their ballots in early voting, a figure considerably above that of prior midterm elections. A booming U.S. economy would seem to favor Trump and the Republicans. The president himself has hammered the issue of immigration, painting caravans of Central American migrants fleeing poverty and violence as a direct threat to American security. Whether it's the great economy or the immigration, our strong stand and their very weak stand where they have open borders, which to me means nothing but crime. Uh, I don't know, but I can tell you that there's a lot of energy. But health care could also be a deciding issue after Republican efforts to repeal Obamacare, with an overwhelming majority of polled voters believing Democrats will prioritize health care more than Republicans. The campaign has been marked by several domestic terror attacks targeting Trump critics and Jews. An immigration-based attack ad from Trump, widely condemned as racist, was pulled from NBC, Fox News, and Facebook on Monday. A Democratic House of Representatives is unlikely to bring impeachment proceedings against Trump, but it could put a halt to the Republican legislative agenda for the rest of his term. Trump himself kicked off his final day campaign blitz before Election Day by saying, everything is at stake.